Hello, Fayetteville State University family. My name is Daryl Allison, and I am both honored and humbled to be selected as your 12th chancellor. I wanna thank the members of the FSU Search Committee, Chairman Stuart Augustine, and the FSU Board of Trustees, UNC System President Peter Hans, and the UNC Board of Governors for this wonderful opportunity. But more importantly, I wanna thank the FSU family, students, faculty, staff, and alumni. You know, in pursuing this role, you wanna make sure that the search committee is aware of all the various accomplishments and, and achievements, and you know, all that's fine, that's important. However, I wanna tell you a little bit more about me. I am a proud country boy from Kannapolis, North Carolina. I was blessed to have two parents who both loved God and worked hard, and they instilled that in their children. And my parents, they did not have a college education, nor could they afford to send one child, yet alone three of the youngest set of children to college. But, but because they made education a priority for us, all three of us were able to get a four-year academic scholarship to attend college. And HBCU made that happen for us. We not only earned our undergraduate degrees, but my brother Rod and I later graduated from the University of North Carolina at Chapel Hill School of Law. And my sister, well, Sharon received her medical degree from East Carolina University. Again, an HBCU, North Carolina Central University to be exact, laid the foundation for us to reach our goals. And so, when I think about Fayetteville State University and the type of students it seeks to reach, educate, and elevate, this is very personal to me. Why, you might ask? Because 30 years ago, I was that kid, a rural county student coming from a family of very modest means. And so now, receiving this opportunity to be the 12th chancellor of this great institution where I, entering the second half of life, can now give back those same opportunities as those students who are just beginning their first half in their lives. FSU family, let's just say it and say it very clearly. This is not an ordinary, plain opportunity for me. This is an opportunity of a lifetime. And so, in keeping with FSU's motto, rest non verba, deeds not words, I promise each of you, FSU alumni, faculty, staff, and students, I'm gonna give you all I have. And I pledge to you that no one will work harder or be more committed to making this great institution even greater. And speaking of this great institution, I want to give a special thanks to Interim Chancellor Peggy Valentine for her outstanding leadership especially during this global pandemic. Lastly, FSU, you should also know I come as a package deal as my wife of 22 years, Lanisa, and our two beautiful daughters, Dayana and Dayla, are absolutely thrilled to become a member of the Bronco family. And so with that, Fayetteville State, it's time for me to get to work. I thank you and God bless. Bronco pride.